A leadership learning moment. Start fresh. Six steps to follow to rehire yourself. By Michael Holland. Remember those feelings of the first days and weeks in a new job. The thrill of learning a new environment. The freedom from office politics and gossip. The flood of ideas. The intrigue with meeting your employees for the first time. The adrenaline rush of opportunity to make an impact. And the unwavering belief of your boss and peers in your ability to have great success. Recreate it. Start fresh by declaring bankruptcy on your leadership role and rehiring yourself into your position. Today is your first day of your first week of your first month in the job. Clear your calendar. Declare bankruptcy on your to-do list and let the fog roll into your memories of relationships. Start everything anew. Highlight your role description. Read your role description with fresh eyes and highlight in bright orange the key aspects of the role. Ignore what you think you know about the job and focus on what stands out as exciting to you. Two, reintroduce yourself to your employees. Have a peer leader or trained facilitator run a new manager integration process to reestablish the relationships, expectations with employees. Three, craft a vision. Explore your why via this Simon Sinek video. Then craft a vision for your team for the new season you are entering and align your resources around the vision. Four, get to know your stakeholders. Develop a stakeholder chart of key peers and teams with whom you'll need to establish relationships. Think anew regarding how, what, and why you are connected to each stakeholder or stakeholder group. Create a new GTD list. Get control from the start with a personal and organizational productivity approach that can transform how you get things done. Six, get started. Champion and enable the execution of your plans. Lean forward and make that first step. Need some inspiration? Learn how to start stuff via Seth Godin's inspiring book, Poke the Box. Create the opportunity to allow yourself to be fully motivated for your leadership role. Rehiring yourself will allow your mind to discard old baggage that weighs you down and explore established boundaries that enable you to be more effective. Coaching thoughts for you and your peers. One, which idea in the list would be the easiest for you to start with? Two, grab a peer manager and convince them to partner up with you to go through the rehiring process together. Why do you think it would be better doing it together? Three, which idea in the list would provide the most growth for you in your current season of leadership? Four, how do you envision your employees would react to you going through this process? How about your boss? Thank you for listening to this leadership learning moment. To learn more about how to lead well, visit our website at bishophouse.com.